Did you know that Will Smith lost a million dollars per month after the Oscar slap? Oh, wow. Let me tell you the crazy story of the infamous slap and how it changed the actor's life forever. It all started with a joke Chris Rock made about Jada's hair. You see, Jada suffers from a medical condition called alopecia. It's a condition that causes people to lose most or all of their hair over time. Jada has been wearing turbans for a while, until she finally revealed the reason why. I've been having issues with hair loss. It was terrifying when it, when it first started, and then just handfuls of hair just in my hands. It wasn't easy for her, and she went through a pretty rough patch. It all started with him just needing some help. I was in a lot of pain, and I was very broken. I just wanted to feel good. It had been so long since I felt good. Because I wasn't sure I was ever going to speak to you again. The fact that I'm speaking to you again is, is, a, <laughs> is a miracle. But eventually, she got better and started making jokes about it. So when she showed up at the Oscars with her signature shaved head, Chris Rock decided to take a dig at her. Jada, I love you. G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it. All right? Basically, comparing her to G.I. Jane, a famously bold female character. Will Smith laughs, but Jada clearly looks annoyed at a joke. And that's when Will Smith gets up, walks up to Chris Rock, and slaps him in the face. Chris Rock takes it as a joke. That was the greatest night in the history of television. While Will Smith is still yelling at him. Keep my wife's name out your mouth! Will Smith goes on to actually win an Oscar the same night. He accepts the award and gives a teary-eyed apology to the Academy and to the nominees. I want to apologize to the Academy. I want to apologize to my, all my fellow nominees. Everyone but Chris Rock. And the aftermath, Will Smith gets banned from the Academy Award for 10 years, loses 8,000 followers per day on his Instagram, and every single one of his movie projects gets put on hold. His brand new movie, Emancipation, also tanks, cause fans refuse to watch his movies. One thing that's killing me, Emancipation, is Antoine's masterpiece. It's like these top artists in the world have done some of the best work of their career. Yeah. And the idea that they might be denied because of me is like, oh, that is, is killing me dead. He has since issued a public apology to Chris Rock on his Insta and even made a YouTube video talking about the incident and how he has reached out to Chris to apologize. Chris, the message that came back is that uh, he's not ready to talk and when he is, he will reach out. Even though Chris Rock isn't happy to accept Will Smith's apology, he seems to have moved on from the incident and says he's back to work and will eventually talk about it. And people are waiting to hear from him, which is obvious in his massive increase of followers on Instagram. Even though Will Smith slapped Chris Rock to defend his wife, everyone seems to have forgotten the why because of what he did. And it's gonna take him a long time to get over that.